but ticket sales are not going well. Debbie, it's Harvey. Um, I'm just chasing up figures on Saxon. What's the latest? 207. That's not very good. With sales very slow, Harvey's come up with a rocktacular stunt to shift the remaining tickets. This afternoon, at half time, in the game between Sheffield Wednesday and Sunderland, that massive tune will be ringing out of the sound system at Hillsborough. The plan is to gain vital press attention by breaking the record for most people simultaneously air guitaring. And a world record will be smashed. Lead singer of Saxon is the legendary Biff Byford, and he is on the line now. Biff, good morning to you. Good morning. It's, uh, it's good to be on the airwaves. You've got Sheffield Wednesday against Sunderland today. If you're going along, what do you need to take part in this world record? You, you do need all you need is two arms. Well, one arm is okay as well. But um, yeah, you just need to uh, do the air guitar thing, and uh, you know, facial expressions are optional. I think the record's maybe four thousand. I think, but uh, we're open to smash that. It's a bit of fun. In three hours, thirty thousand die-hard football fans will watch Sheffield Wednesday and Sunderland clash. At half-time, the pitch is Saxons. Sean, the PA announcer, will introduce you and the fans will be encouraged to participate for the duration of five minutes. Yeah. And right. create this world record. Yeah, yeah. We expect about 30,000 today. Whoa. Perfect. So that's excellent. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What will happen is oh, that we will yeah. be in place down this side here. OK. And all the players will be running by you. OK. Do not touch their asses. OK. OK. Can we, can we give it this one? <laughs> <laughs> because they enjoy it. Exactly. Yeah. Perfect. We all clear with this? Yeah. So, band, follow me. Although Harvey's throwing Saxon into the lion's den, if they pull off this stunt, he's confident it will have lasting results. I just want to explain to you what this is all about while we're doing it. This is going to be a talking point event. When I did Pavarotti in Hyde Park in 93, and it was bucketing with rain, and I got the Princess Diana and the, the whole cabinet and the rest of the royal family to take their umbrellas down, from that point onwards, people, even today, bump into me and go, I was there, you know. So this is, this is an exercise involving an audience. They're gonna remember this day for a bloody long time because they're part of it. And if we get this world record, Every single one of these people in this stadium are going to be Saxon fans from here on in because they're going to be part of history. And that's what this is all about. So, let's go. As it happens, with all my ups and downs on this project, there are a lot of press here. More press than actually I expected to turn up on a windy day in the winter. And I think there is an opportunity for Saxon to really get some coverage. It's a bit like waiting in the biggest well, dentist, say, dentist like the dressing room. It's the gladiator's it. den. Yeah. <laughs> in the gladiator's pit. Exactly. It's like waiting for a lobotomy or something. <laughs> <laughs> bird seed. Everybody going to do bird seed? Right. Stand by, everybody. Here we go. <laughs> we need. Uh, that's what we need. Some fucking alcohol. Afterwards. We got any wine? Let's go, guys. Oh my God. <laughs> if you could follow Barney Owl, okay. he will lead the way. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a great pleasure to us all. Please put your hands together and welcome to Hillsborough, the world legend Saxon. <laughs> Sutherland fans and Sheffield Wednesday fans, come on, let's make history.
After three minutes, Harvey pulls the band off the pitch. And go for it. The stunt has not gone as planned. That was the worst three minutes I've ever fucking spent in my life. 